Um, uh, election Wizard says, often when the elites have railroaded the populist in the United States, the elites have soon faced a massive populist backlash and been thrown out. Uh, too much role of, of power this time. What's your prediction? That's my. That's what I think is coming. I think a major populist backlash is coming. Really? So I, I think that, and, and they're going to fight by every means and tool, by hook or by crook, to try to prevent it. But this is where I agree with uh, Michael Malice, who's writing a book called White Pill, currently. And uh, his view is a, uh, a, a rising empire doesn't look like the green zone from Baghdad and have a dementia candidate for president. And that's the sign of a declining empire, a dying empire that knows it's dying. Uh, and I think at some level they do. And this is a they're going to this is when they lash out the most. Uh, but I do think it's going to trigger a back. I've seen it from all kinds of places. People who weren't even active before didn't care about politics. So enraged by what the system is trying to do that they're finding any way conceivable to engage. There's going to be people who finally realize how a powerful local government can be because they actually control how elections are done. That are going to be running for little positions, city council, county commission. The way it, this all, for a populist revolution to work, it needed to always be bottom up. It could never succeed top down. Uh, and they're forcing that to happen. And that's where I think they've overstepped their bounds. They would have, I think the system would have been better off with a second term of Trump than what they're about to face.